For the last 900 days, rain, shine, or even snow, Bob Purdy has taken to the waters around the province on his stand-up paddleboard to make changes to the planet. We've got environmental challenges, we've got social challenges, we've got uh, economic challenges, so uh, all those three pillars. And uh, my belief is, is that uh, if we can get to you know, one person at a time and get them to make a change in one of those areas, it'll affect all the other areas and uh, eventually we'll see an, an improved health of the planet. Last year, Purdy invited paddlers from around the globe to join him in World Paddle for the Planet Day in the hopes of inspiring change in others. And we saw some incredible changes. There was a fellow in Alaska that has a kayak touring company up there that banned plastic water bottles from his touring company, which is really cool. At home in the Okanagan, this paddler has inspired those like Sandy McGee to get out on the water. Just the dedication to, to paddle 900 days in a row and uh, you're standing out here. It's not a great morning. You, you can imagine what it's like in January and the fact that he's raising money for a great cause, uh, you have to support that. Purdy fundraises for the David Suzuki Foundation, but this October, when he heads out to Florida for his second annual World Paddle Day, he will raise money for Mother Ocean, a charity that helps with trash pickup in waterways. We just got the first chapter going right here in Kelowna. It's the first chapter in Canada. So every Saturday morning, we're somewhere out there from 9 till 10 in the morning uh, picking up trash and, uh, you know, just bringing uh, awareness to, you know, how we look after things. When be sure to look for Purdy out on the water as he continues his daily paddle until the end of this year. Jen Zielinski in Kelowna for Castanet News.